If that's wrong, Conrad, let me know, but I think that's what I was told. And I better get going, because my songs are kind of long. There was someone who asked for a certain cover on one of the, the posts, and I don't think I'll get to it, because I want time. If I don't, then I will play it during my stream next Thursday, um, in which I will have a lot more time. Alright. 20 minutes now long, I'm gonna get going. This song's called Songwriting. I started writing songs cause that's what my brother did and ever since I can't remember I just wanted to be like him until he started doing things that made me uncomfortable like hitchhiking out to Cali then train hopping back home but he wrote songs of his adventures and they were inspiring so I recorded them on my phone so they would always be with me but I lost them when I got mad and threw my phone off a cliff his songs were few of many that I lost when I did this so when he gave me his guitar I taught myself to play his songs hoping one day at a show he would ask me to play along I learned by playing all his songs as well as Gary Acro and James and after all these years I guess I just wanted to say thanks well, I've been a part of this community since just 14 years old and I still do not know how much value I really hold because I seem to place my worth on what I hear you people say but I'm too scared to stick around for the whole show to hear it anyway it's not many to my real name or who I am when I don't sing and I know it's my own fault but it's the truth and it can sting but now that you know my system I feel like the data is all flawed but not as flawed as I am when I think you want me gone I have a confession to make and I am being quite sincere and I say when I first came out to shows I thought you were something to fear I guess my dad got in my head and knowing him I should know better but I used to think a punk can never be a Christian debtor and I feared when you discovered how religious that I was I would be kicked out of the only place I really came to love you don't believe the things I do I don't believe the things you do but you believe in me and I believe in you I'm afraid of confrontation, yet I always start the fight I'm bipolar, and sometimes I just can't see what is right Yeah, things can get real tough sometimes, that's what I try to sing about Even if my poor vocabulary makes it hard to pick that out And I often do songwriting, cause it feels so therapeutic to let out All these emotions I just don't know what to do with and I always do my best to be kind to those I write about Unless that someone is myself, because I'm not someone that I care about I put an inside joke in every song I ever write But no one ever knows to laugh because I won't let them inside and so now I'm in therapy to work on liking who I am and I feared that when this started I wouldn't write a song again because I'd have a healthy outlet for all the things I hid inside but it turns out I can't do both now and I'm starting to feel alive I must correct myself because I'm sure I'll always want to die but I can start to see why some people enjoy being alive well, I was asked once why I talk so much about depression Why if I want to help people do I just keep screaming at them And I swear I have an answer But it's quite hard to explain I guess Cause I have so many friends with chemically imbalanced brains And they feel lonely but hopeless or undesired Or just scared that they are The only ones with these emotions around them seem to flare It's like they're looking at the world while locked inside a little cage And I just want them to understand that I've often felt the same And I have many friends who try their best to understand our pain when we are hurting but they've never had a problem with their brains And because it is so painful When the good friends get it wrong We just stay silent So I try to explain all that in a song And try again And again and try again And then again Because emotions are so difficult To explain to our friends But I also sing songs about depression About rage, about social anxieties And suicidal states Because I have to keep reminding myself That being alive is right And that there are some things and people That make all this worth the fight well, sometimes when I write a song, I get real proud of myself until I go to the next show, and then I listen to someone else, and I think maybe it's best if I quit and never waste my time on all this music and emotion and getting it to rhyme, and I could be the guy who goes to every show but never sings, and every band knows his face well but can't quite remember his name, and I can support indie music from the comfort of my room, and no one would look at me and say, don't you write music too, because when people notice me, I'd rather be my phone thrown off a cliff, I still don't know the difference between a progression and a riff I'm just a cute to tell sad stories while holding a guitar and this all feels like a dream or a nightmare that went too far I also do my best to address some happy thoughts cause there are too many bands that only sing sad songs or they sing about corruption or oppression or of hate 
And I'm sure we can find joyful things to which we can relate. For example, I have a brother who encouraged me when he gave me his guitar. And he told me I could sing and people would listen because I mattered to them. And I will always fight the stage fright to feel that love again. And I had a friend whose talent was far superior. Say, I want you on my show. Cause I have somebody who needs to hear you. You may struggle with your voice or getting the guitar the way you want it. But you can show emotion in ways that anyone can feel it. And I didn't know for a long time if my music had any value. But a friend called me up recently saying there's something I should tell you. You see, I left my house intending this night to be my last. And I got out my iPod and I put it on full blast. And I heard you sing. No, more than that because it wasn't the music I felt you sing. But hope and recovery and I knew I could still do this. My friend is out there somewhere still traveling these states. And I write music because I know somehow, somewhere, someone will relate. Vic, thanks guys. There's a lot going on in the chat and I can't read it from here, but I'll, I'll look back at it later. Uh, sorry if I'm not responding to any questions or anything. Um, this one I wrote this week, last week, I don't remember. I showed it to a couple friends and they told me to play it today. I'm still unsure about how I feel about it, but I'll trust them. I like thinking I can make it through whatever making it means in the moment I am thinking about. In the moment I am thinking about. Making it through these weeks in my room instead of going off to school or to one of a long list of things my therapist and me have been writing down to get me out of my head. To get me out of my head. To get me out of my head has been shaking up lately. Along with all my friends here in Salt Lake and all of the things on our walls, the things on our walls. The things on our walls, the things on our walls. So I look for comfort in the things that I used to take for granted. Say, sitting out in the sun, eating breakfast with my grandma. I teach her how to use her phone. She tells me stories from many years ago. She says, I like thinking I can make it. I like thinking I can make it. I like thinking I can make it. If she can leave her room when her world's falling apart, perhaps I can leave mine when it isn't. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Somebody is working outside the house, working on the deck, and they started hammering right when I finished, and it sounded like clapping, and that was really funny. Is it 110? Is that the time? Am I halfway? Me and my guitar are crossing the butter. That's why it sounds weird. Really, I don't I'm not supposed to use a capo. That that felt really weird to sing. Me and my guitar are crossing the border Gonna meet up with a couple of friends down by the river First time out of the States to play my own songs for people that I've never met With hours ago, is it too early to be nervous? If I'm a name on a flyer in a rundown venue, I wouldn't have it any other way. If I'm the venue spent to get you into this show, I hope you get to hear your favorite band play. When the music's over and it's time to go, 
home. I just wanna hear you say this night was worth it. said he wanted to hear. It's usually the song I end with, but I think I'll have a couple minutes extra, so I'll play a short one after. What I did, Russ, I missed it. Or at least that's the best way so far that you found to explain the way that you're feeling. And I know you've been taking things out on yourself because old decisions you made have brought you to this place. I see a dandelion growing up through the concrete. And I'm sure that is not where it would like to be. But imagine the strength it took it to break free. Say it's not enough to be a flower in the streets When you look up and see all your friends as great oak trees But they really love you And they want to help you They're not growing so high to make you feel so low They're trying to show you how to make your own roots grow Please take my hand, I'm reaching out for you I know in time you will make it through You wrote me a letter you said this time you'll try harder No guarantee that you'll be here For more than a week I said friend, one week's a good starter And I've been in your place So broken and afraid Where I hid from the world When all I needed was an embrace No, I see a lighthouse Steadfast in the billows You're nearly drowning yourself You don't say a word Tell everybody else it's gotten out of the storm You say it's not enough to help everyone get out Cause now that they're okay you are alone in the swell But they really love you And they want to help you They're not leaving the waves to make you feel unsafe They're marking the path to get you out of harm's way Please take my hand, I'm reaching out for you I know in time you will make it through Well I wrote the first letter this time I'm not waiting around to get your goodbye I know life's treating you hard tonight We've made it through hard 
at times I did my best to explain to you That I know how it feels like walking those shoes I won't promise life gets better with time But I promise you to I tried to write what you mean to me But how can words explain these feelings If you are feeling alone tonight You can always talk with me You wrote me a letter You said you're doing better Well, sometimes you're angry But you are still here You take that to mean that somehow you still care Holding on tight to the things that you've got It's one day at a time But things are looking up I wrote you a letter 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 And I did my best to explain to you That I know how it feels like watching those shoes I won't promise life gets better with time But I promise you do I tried to write what you mean to me But I can't wait to explain these feelings If you are feeling alone tonight You can always talk with me so I wrote you a letter <laughs> How much time do I have? Am I out? Is someone able to see the time? Eric is texting me to say something. You got scars on your body that remind you of your tragedies. I've got mine, but mine are in mentality. I guess that's what it means now to be alive. And I never treat mine even for a complete mind. I know you trace yours to remind yourself it's all behind. I guess that's what it means. Now to feel alive well, Everybody's talking about them good old days And I guess sometimes I do do the same But I feel much better now that I've let them go The good old days were full of knives and empty bottles And the good old me was wild and uncontrollable I know I'm different now, but I feel whole Thanks, guys. Uh, definitely go check out Gary's page next and donate to the Beehive if you can. Thanks for watching.